Good morning, my dear student. Our lesson today is symmetrical figure and the axis of symmetry. Lesson one in unit four. Here we notice that this line divide each figure into identical parts. That means if we can fold it, the figure around this line is called symmetrical figure and this line known as axis of symmetry. We have some figures like a collateral triangle. Collateral triangle has three axes of symmetry and isosceles triangle has one axis of symmetry. Scan triangle has zero axis of symmetry. We have some figure has zero axis of symmetry and some figure has one axis and some figures has more than one axis of symmetry. Like parallelogram has zero axis of symmetry and rhombus two axis of symmetry and rectangle has two axis of symmetry. And we have square. Square has four axis of symmetry. Trapezium has no axis of symmetry, zero axis. And the isosceles trapezium has one axis of symmetry. Axis of symmetry, straight line L is considered to be an axis of symmetry for the figure F. If every point on that figure has identical point on the same figure, here this point has identical point in the same figure with respect to the line L. The second part in this lesson, geometric transformation, we have three colored triangle. The colored triangle is transformed to another position by reflection, translation or rotation. Reflecting the figure, which is called reflection, moving the figure in a certain direction, which is called translation, and turning the figure around point, around angle D, at a gamble, a certain, with a certain angle, which is rotation. So we have three geometric transformations, reflection, translation, and rotation. A geometric transformation transform every point A in the plan to another point A dash in the plan itself. Here, first, we have reflection. We have straight line A, B, it's called axis of reflection. And this point has image in another direction. The original figure and the image are congruent, are two congruent figure, must be congruent. If we draw straight, if we draw a line segment from point to its image, this line segment perpendicular to axis of reflection. Reflection across a line. If we need the reflection of point A, here we count one, two, three, four. So in the another direction we move four step one, two, three, four. So this point is called the image of point A, A and A dash. If we need draw the image of point B, one, two, three. The distance is equal to 3, so in another direction 
we move three, one, two, three, and draw the image of point B. This is called point B dash. And image of C, one, two, we draw point C dash. In another direction. And point D, one, so put point D here, D dash, the image of point D. To the image of a line segment by reflection, like we need find the image of A, B. First must be find the image of A, one, two, three, four. So move four steps. One, two, three, four. So A dash the image of A, and also B dash the image of B. Then draw this line. It's called the reflection of line segment A B. So to find the image of A B by reflection cross L, find the image of point A by reflection across L. Label at a dash to find the image of point B by reflection across L. Label at B dash. Then draw line segment A dash B dash to be the line to be the image of line segment by reflection across L. We need find the image of point C. So, one, two, three, one, two, three, this point, C, dash, belong also, A, dash, B, dash, because C belong A, B, so the image of C belong also A, dash, B, dash. If we put point, belong L and we point D and we find the image of point D we note that the same point so if the point D belong the axis of reflection this uh, the image the same point so if A not belong L then L bisects the perpendicular segment A, A dash. If B belong L, then B dash on sides on B, the same point. A, B and B dash, the same position and the same. In this bracket, we need to find the image of this line segment, first line segment A, B, first must be find the image of point A, count 1, 2, 3, so 1, 2, 3 and what point A, it's called A dash, and the image of B, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, so count 7 in another direction, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This point called B dash, the image of B, and draw line segment A dash B dash. So the image of line segment A B by reflection across L is called A dash B dash and if we find the image of C D C belong L so the reflection of C is C and D belong also L so the reflection is also D so the image of C D by reflection across L is C line segment C D. We need to find 
the image of geometric figure by reflection to find the image of figure find the image of all vertices this figure here the triangle has three vertices we find a the image of a a dash and b b dash and c c dash then draw the figure this reflection across l we said before the image of figure is congruent by the original figure here we need find the reflection of this figure across l count one two three so one two three and what a dash and b one two three four five six one two three four five six and this point b dash and the point d belong l so the image itself and point c one two three so count one two three then put c dash then draw the figure this figure called the image of figure a b c d the image is a dash b dash c dash d Draw axis of symmetry to make one of the following figure an image to the other. To draw axis of symmetry must be draw on the same distance from two figures. So we draw here axis of symmetry and we can set that this original figure and this image. And here must to be put the axis of symmetry on the same distance from the two figures to give me the two congruent figure and here we draw axis of symmetry in this figure we need find the image of this point of this figure across L First, we can count one and one, two, three, one, two, three. So, draw three, then two, here two, so two, then move one step then down one step then move here we are one step So find the image of this figure. One, two, three. So draw one, two, three. Then down one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Then move one, two, three, one, two, three. and so on. Find the image of this point, one, two, three, one, two, three, then put this point, and one, two, one, two,
वन टू थ्री फोर वन टू थ्री फोर वन टू थ्री वन टू फोर फाइव फोर फाइव 